thought that you was a shy girl Until I made you my girl Girl, you push me like a big boy Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Slim Rache here, aka Jasmine, and I'm back to you with another video. So today I'll be doing my top 10 favorite hairstyles from 2015 and 2016. I got this idea from my twin. I'll put the link to her video in the description box below. So if you guys are interested in this video, please continue watching. So the first hairstyle, I'm not going in any particular order, is this. And this hairstyle, y'all, literally, I killed the game. <laughs> I got this wig um, from the beauty supply store. And if I can remember what the name is, I'll put it in the description box below. If you don't see it, then I don't remember. I don't have the packaging with me. Um, but it was like ombre black roots to red, like curly natural curl texture. And I bought it for a fashion show. And when I tell y'all, everybody thought, I don't know why, but people thought this was my real hair and that I dyed it red. And like people were dying over it. And then, I came to school like three days later and people was like, girl, you dyed your hair back black? I was like, that was a wig, y'all. But that was the first wig that I had started wearing and it got me into the wig game. So this hairstyle is really nice as a protective style. You can, you know, keep your hair braided underneath, moisturize and stuff, snatch that thing off at night. <laughs> so second, I am going to show you guys this hairstyle which was my 21st birthday hair it was Eunice Peruvian straight and it was I believe 18 20 22 and 24 if not it was 20 22 24 26 and it was straight hair it was so cute and then I curled it and this is what it looked like and yeah it was just so pretty so thick for it to be Peruvian straight hair and I just loved it no tangles no like just shedding it was bomb hair so the third hairstyle i'm gonna show y'all is this brazilian kinky curly hair disclaimer this hair the hair itself was not good hair at all i learned that after like messing with it and stuff it was terrible hair however your girl hooked it up so this is the way the hair looked um when I first bought it and first installed it, this was my first time getting a closure and I usually do my hair myself. So that was my first time installing a closure on myself. This is how it looked. It was so thick, so voluptuous. Like y'all, I love this hair. I lied to you now. I loved it, loved it, loved it. So then after it started getting a little like naughty and stuff, I was like, okay, I'ma wash it. <laughs> And so when I washed the hair, bam, this was the natural texture. Now, usually when you buy hair, you don't want the texture to change that much when you wash it because then you'll never get that original texture of the hair back. Um, but I was okay with it because the more I washed the hair and conditioned it, the softer it was, the easier it was to manage and things like that. So this is how it looked when it was in its natural state. And by this time, I, I think I installed it two different times. The first time I did like an actual sew-in with closure sewed on. And then when I took it out, I made it into a wig so I could snatch that thing off at night, put it back on, and all of that. And so this is how it looked. And then the third style that I did with this hair, I blow dried it and then I flexi rotted it. And so this is how it looks. And when I tell you, it looked like a natural girl bantu not out like it was popping y'all like popping um so yeah let me talk about my buns okay so last year i really got into doing wearing buns protective styles and so this is one of the hairstyles i would do my mini mouse buns and i would do it on straight hair i would do it on curly hair i would do it low in the back with a hat on transitioning into another bun hairstyle my low sleek bun which i had tutorials for that bun as well i'll put it in the description box below 
I used to rock that bun all the time, especially when I was growing my shaved sides out. And so that sleek low bun was easy for me to have my shaved sides. My third bun look was my top knot ninja bun, which I also have a tutorial for that. I'll put that in the description box below. And y'all, like, this was literally easy peasy lemon squeezy like so yeah that's another one i lost count i don't know what number i'm on <laughs> um but the next hairstyle that i will talk to you guys about is this wig so this is a video of me and my twin and this is the same girl i was talking about who made her video which is in the description box below we bought the same wig because it was so cute and like we was always over the summer together and I lied to you not we had so many people like was like oh my gosh she was just over there no she was just over there I was like cuz we twins what you mean we bought this wig it was so thick when I tell y'all it was so thick it was too thick we both had to straighten the wig because it was like way too thick but it was natural it was synthetic However, it was so soft. It was just like natural hair. Um, and so like we both straightened them. Um, I think she wound up trimming hers or something like that. But it was really nice. Could just throw it on. It was full so you didn't have to worry about like your tracks and seams and stuff and your braid showing. It was really nice. It was hot. That's the only thing. I would not recommend that wig for over the summer because it is hot. So next. I'm going to show you guys my natural hair. When I started trimming it after it started growing out, I will wear these sleek hairstyles like hair straight to the back or like a middle part and it split straight down the middle um, and then sometimes I would curl it up. So this was another favorite hairstyle that I would do and then let me see if I have any more. I don't know how I forgot about these, but this was a flexi rod set on my real hair with my shave size braided. And then this is a wig called Katrina. Okay, you guys. So that's the last hairstyle that I can think of. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please give it a huge thumbs up, like, comment, and subscribe. Share. Tell your mama, your sister, your cousin, your brother, your auntie, your uncle, your baby mama, your kids. <laughs> Tell everybody to subscribe and share this video. Um, again, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see y'all in my next one. Bye, guys.